This is the front. I cut this side level. Then this side, eight. This is the waistband. Our waist is 28. Hi, thanks for stopping by. Are you just seeing my video for the first time? Please, after watching, subscribe to my channel. Like this video, leave your comment below. What you want me to sew next? Let me know. Share this video and God bless you. So this is the waist band. 31 and a half inches. This is the belt. This is the cross belt. What I have here is 23 and a half. The cross belt is depending on the measurement, the person you took her measurement. So this person's length, the cross belt was 22 inches it's not compulsory you must cut your cross bed with 22 inches you cut it according to the person's length this is 23 and a half plus the sewing allowance this is the skirt i have it two part here this is the front side this is the back side too so the length I have here 23 and a half for the length. This side of it, I cut it 47 inches. Remember the waist measurement is 28 and I cut this very one 47 because we are going to be doing some gather. I'm going to gather this place. I'm going to gather. I'm going to sew gather to gather here. Okay. I'm going to gather this place. Then this is the band that is going to be here. After I've sewed this place gather, this one will be here. I hope you can see that. This very one will be here on the chest. After I've sewed this very one here. I'm taking it to the machine, but I'm just trying to show you something. Okay. So this one will be here. This one will be here. This is going to be the belt that will be here and here. I hope it's clear. So Right now, I'm going to iron gum stain on the waistband. You turn the side that is shiny, the shiny parts, you turn it upside down. After gumming the gum stain, you trim it off the excess. Make sure the front is facing the front. I'm going to measure two inches. I will sew it down. Straight. Make sure your hand is straight on the machine so that the sewing will be straight because this is the belt. The belt of the pinafore. I will sew both sides. Trim off the SS allowance. Sew this place. Then after sewing it, you turn it like this. Turn it inside out before ironing it. But first of all, I want to seal up that place. The two belts. Then after that, 
I will turn it and iron it very well. This is how you should turn it inside out. I'm using my scissors. You can use pen, pencil, or even a stick to turn it out. But I'm using my scissors. I'm going to iron it very well. Then after ironing it, I will top stitch it. I will sew it round. This is the one that is going to be in the front, the front on the chest side. I'm going to sew it round. I also sew the side, but the damp part, I'm not going to sew that side. I've already sewed it, I iron it, and I top stitch it round. I'm going to sew it round. This is the band. I have drawn two gather on the skirt already. How you can get your gather? You make sure the sewing is not tight. You just sew two lines, sew it to the ending, and make sure the sewing is not tight, and start gathering it like this. I'm going to mark one and a half for the zip allowance. Let's finish it. Zip allowance. One and a half. This is the zip side, so I will sew this place now to this place. Then I will face zip this side. Here is the band. So, what we have? We have thirty inches. Not up to 30 and a half. So, this is the same bag I folded. This side, because the person's weight is 28. So, I folded this side. 14 and a half. Then, this very part is the zip to fix the hook. So, what I'm going to do right now. I'm just going to notch it to get the middle. Forty inches. But what I have there is forty and a half. You will measure forty inches. The half inch is for the sewing allowance. You can see that then this is the uh, waistband this is the back this is the front all we are going to do now is to place it here measure this side one and a half measure this side one and a half you can see that i notched the middle because the other part of it is for the hook. So you measure one and a half this way. And measure one and a half this way. And notch the middle. Place the second part on top. That is the waistband. going to sew it round to the ending this is the skirt but meanwhile I'm going to iron the top very well before I sew the skirts make sure the measurement is exactly the person's waist the person's waist is 28 that's 14 28 divided into 2, you have 14. So make sure the person's measurement is what you are using. That is where I'm going to fix my hook. So 
so i'm going to work on the back you know the belt need to start from the back i'm just going to notch it to get the middle the center you know that is the middle this is the belt I'm just trying to show you how it's going to be. And there's going to be little excess down there. I'll trim it off. Make sure from this side to this side is several inch. From this middle from to the other side is several inch. Several plus several gives you 14. And 40 plus 40 will give you 28. The person's waist is 28 inches. I have not sewed it i just pinned it to show you how it's going to be i'm going to sew it right away i have sewed it now it's time to fix the skirt i'm going to sew the skirt to the waist and i will get back to you have you subscribed to my channel please like this video here is the ad come look at how beautiful this pinafore is Oh my god, so beautiful. The owner was not at home to wear it so that you will see how beautiful it is on her. She was not at home. So beautiful. Thanks for watching. Please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe, like this video, leave your comment below. And if you have questions about how to tie button, how to make buttonhole, on your clothes please let me know at the comment section share this video remember to click on the notification bell after subscribing thank you so much i really appreciate if you watch to this time god bless you ciao